Hello again. Pivot table to creating a flat file. A flat file is generally a store of data and it's commonly used in transferring data between one system and another, i.e. from one database to another, or is used as a lookup table uh, in a spreadsheet. The problem with pivot tables is, although they're very good at consolidating data into a, a really good format, um, they're quick and easy, the output they produce is not in the correct format for a, a flat file. Here we can see an example pivot table. You can see that um, it has multiple account lines for every single project line. And this is not the best format for a flat file. This is an example of the type of file you get if you copy and paste from a pivot table. As you can see, it's very, very similar to the pivot table with the same missing data. This is what a flat file should look like. You can see that the uh, project number detail, the first column, is present for every single uh, row. Now all programs should be able to reference the rest of the data OK. OK, let's, so let's look at an Excel example. OK, so we have a pivot table here. Let's go ahead and copy the data we require to a new sheet. And we'll just paste in data. Now you can see in column B that we have all of the project detail um, and you can see that various of the rows that the data is missing. So if we just select all of that data, press F5 or Control and G, um, you get the go to box, um, then press Alt S or Special. And we'll get the special selection. Now select blank and OK. You can now see that um, all of the, the blank cells have been selected. <coughs> now let's go and enter equals and then up and we've selected the, the data above. If we then press control and enter you will find that all of the data has been entered into the missing blanks. That's just about it. This has been an excelling.co.uk video tutorial. Thanks for watching.